So I got a lot of questions about this via DM and comments. I thought I'd make a short video just to show you guys how to do it. And the question is, how do you use the symmetry tool in Manga Studio? So I've got a canvas here and let me just show you how you do this. So simply over here on the toolbar area, you select ruler. Okay, so you've got a bunch of different rulers in here and the one ruler that you'd be interested in is the symmetrical ruler. So this appeared, I believe, in Manga Studio 5, so if you have an older version, you might not have it. So I pick the symmetrical ruler, and down here, I can pick the number of lines. So let me just start off with the default, which is 2. And so then you just basically begin to draw your line. It can be any angle you want. So I'm just going to try to keep it fairly straight. It's not perfectly straight, but good enough for, uh, for this. So now this is my symmetry line. So basically anything on the right will be mirrored on the left. So I, let me just grab a pencil here. So now I can go ahead and begin to draw. And now everything is nice and symmetrical. Let's do this really quick. Let's see what symmetry is, you know. You don't have to worry about lining everything up. Here we go. Here's my uh, bald symmetrical dude. So that is using just a simple symmetry tool. Now you can start to get even fancier. So let me just uh, create a new layer. And now to make it a little bit more interesting, let's try to go back to that symmetrical ruler. And let's adjust the number of lines. So this thing right here was set to 2. I'm going to up it now. Let's go to 12. Let's go to 12. So there's also an angle adjustment you can make here, which I'm just going to leave at the default. And uh, yeah, so let's draw my symmetry line. So it's going to take the first spot that I touched it and it's going to originate from that. So now I've got 12 symmetry lines. The area in each one of these will be mirrored on the other 11. So I'm going to come in here. So you can imagine you can start to do some pretty cool stuff. Let's go crazy. So I'm sure there's lots of applications for this. You can get all well, your drawn flowers or your drawn tire rims or whatever, or doing some industrial design. You can have a lot of fun with this tool. Um, I haven't actually used this one for any pieces of art yet, but uh, I could actually already see some cool uses for this. I'm thinking uh, if I was going to do a Doctor Strange uh, piece from the movie there, uh, if you look at a lot of the patterns that he makes, um, a lot of them could probably be created with a tool like this pretty quickly and a lot easier than drawing them uh, from scratch. So this is a great tool. This is in Manga Studio 5. The symmetry ruler, once again, is look on the toolbar here, third from the bottom. Now I'm not sure if it's like that for everybody or if it's just like that on mine, but third from the bottom is my little triangle ruler. And in there, there's a bunch of different selections you can make up top on the sub tool. So you want to pick ruler and then pick symmetrical ruler at the bottom. And that, I believe, is only available, like I mentioned earlier, for uh, Manga Studio 5 and newer. And then, yeah, so just uh, just play around with it. I have a lot of fun. It's, uh, it's a great tool, and it definitely helps speed things up, and it, uh, it's, it's fun. All right, guys, let me know in the comments if there's uh, any other tool or feature you'd like me to provide uh, a little bit of information on how to use. I'll be happy to do so. Um, this tool is also available in... Uh, in the Sketchbook Pro. It's not as powerful as the Manga Studio version, but if you do have Sketchbook Pro, um, it's available there as well, just a simple, single ruler. So you can uh, you can try that out if that's what you've got available. But if you've got Manga Studio, definitely give it a try, because this is uh, it's a really great feature, and it's something that's uh, not available in a lot of other drawing apps. So uh, give it a try. Let me know how it goes for you. All right, guys, thanks a lot. And uh, yeah, please, if you could, uh, Subscribe and like these videos. I would appreciate it a lot. I'm trying to build up this channel and it's, uh, it's starting off pretty slow, but I need to get those numbers up a bit more so I can justify the time I need to actually create uh, better videos in the future. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye.